maybe of course cursing and saying that he quits. And uh, here's all the crochet's nests. So if you need to find crow shoes, uh, this would be the nest to come over and open them all up. Pretty safe area to do it even in. Track Lord either doesn't know or is neglecting that. Uh, logged off already. And so I'm getting hit by the lava because I'm technically over the lava. You go over here, I won't be. to see if she can grind still in Ashwood. She doesn't know. And uh, just looking along, for some reason the music mysteriously ended. Oh well. There's Endless apparently grinding on those tets of flames. Apparently when they die they drop their jawbone and fly into the ground. Again, here's the flag of Kajaro, or however you pronounce that. I know I'm butchering it. You can tell me later on. Okay, giant schooner is a stealth detector. Probably a boss, unless there's more than one. I'm gonna go ahead and look to see if there's more giant schooners. More bone devils. Yeah, he's a lone schooner. There's the termius schooners, the regular ones, and apparently there's a back ride into the foreigners camp, possibly. Possibly, or is this like in mob town of their own? Oh God. The boss Herziog is hollow pointing me, but I ran out of range. So, there's an RM right there, boss called Herzog. There's Tidios, the warrior. And there's Kofane, the uh, warlock, and they're all apparently traitor, or at least evil Asian. Not going to get closer as the uh, at bosses, they do have stealth detection. So, again, we're going to be running through here to um, the foreigner's camp if I can make it before the uh, stealth ends. So apparently if you do come in from Foreigner's Camp, that is a very quick way over into the swamps. And uh, here we'll go through these guys. So again, Sophian Knights, Sophian Battle Mages. We'll talk about the important NPCs later. Uh, here's the save point for this That guy. assault was intense! This guy actually has a voice because he is the 09 Company Guard. Alright, so if you're looking for Sophian Dispatcher Abel Taranez, He's right here. No cost repair, apparently. So pollution doesn't do damage to your durability. If you didn't know, I did unequip my brawn earlier. Um, and he, of course, does have a shop. I'm pretty sure it's a normal merchant shop. Yeah, it is. And even Captain Cromwell has shown up for this uh, expedition. So he's right here if you need to find him. And there's Theodore Gessel, the Terminus Scholar. And uh, no other NPCs in note over here. So, um, Honey Hunter's apparently over here. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you guys how you, where this spot you would enter in Darkrun would be. After I look at this type of Bozu. Hello, Bozu. Hello. There's so, one of you, Flamewood. Or Ashwood. Uh, crack of skulls and the Tempest killed him. Anyways. Running back up to uh, Dark Man, we'll try to find a way to the Terminus Watchtower later. Uh, you'll see the Dark Rain entrance in like five seconds ish. It's a little pity route. No, it was a mature brand. Uh, not that William can hear me. But yeah, it's a sneaky little route in. Uh, and you can come into via the Dark Rain Canary Guards. Whatever. That is Genaro's but That's a little back entrance. Apparently the leveling event is all screwed up. Like, possibly lobies are getting credit for leveling or something. I have no clue. I haven't looked. I'll look at that after this recording. And, um... Now we're going to be passing back into Pinsule's hunting ground. And I'll be going back along down this area that I didn't skip. Show you guys anything fancy that are over there. Oh, there's another saw headed uh, Banzu. I saw them to aggro that other guy, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, wait here in a little shrubbery. Fennel shrubbery. 
again, dark green music. And uh, 21 seconds left, 20 seconds to set our and counting down until stealth wears off. And um, Evo's poking honey fire poke, of course, being something where you make a window pop up on their screen and team speak. Uh, and says you were poked, or whatever. That's hence my fire statement. Uh, so we're trying to sell a 55 plus 5 X rifle. And uh, now I'm going to go ahead and uh, stealth. There's Ani Hunter, of course, animation canceling and other good stuff. That was cool. I think it's the animation canceled at some point. And uh, driving along, when I'm driving along, walking along more saw headed uh, mobs, more stuff paper mobs. Again, I'll be visiting the Watchtower later. Uh, if I can. More screaming Suba. And uh, from here, you know, there's Track Lord. There's his own again. And we're back at the entrance of uh, Cameron's residence. As you can see, I haven't really seen another dungeon entrance at all, unless that's the term is Watchtower. Oh, the XP event was supposed to end 30 minutes ago. Apparently we have still have triple XP. Huh. Oh well. Of course, for engine cracking scrolls helping me out by uh, letting me run through those mobs with no stealth. So, um... Uh, Aha, uh -huh. Ani Hunter clearing out away from me. As you can see, this is the main. Oh god! That one wasn't uh, an aggro. But as you can see, these guys are the low B side. If you want to grind, you want to grind on this area. Uh, if you're level 60, or 61, I guess, if you whacked a tiger and weren't 100% or a boar. And uh, so this way leads to. The lava area, swamp of blaze. So let's try to find a way to the watchtower now. Now there's no route over here that just ends in buildings, and you know back there is the three uh, trader Asian. Um, who's it? What's it? And, uh, someone else. There's three guys. Uh, that area leads straight to Dark Rain, so it looks like it is going to be along the lava route if we want to get to the watchtower. Uh, no clue if this is in any way important. Pretty sure I scouted this entire area. I either was at the Watchtower when I wasn't looking. Actually, yeah, I think the term is Watchtower is that area where those Asian bosses are. I'm gonna go ahead and double check before I end the recording. And, uh, yeah, that's gonna be the whole Velasca Giovanni's area. In general. I do apologize if you hear random sniffling and all that. I am slightly sick. And Fraps does record a high thing. So, yeah, that's the watch term is Watchtower. Apparently, the guys that were watching kind of wanted to kill us. So we know that guy uses hollow point over there, or it's Zog. Uh, let's go ahead and get charged by the warrior, and or maybe fireballed by the warlock. Woo, emo dive. Alright, he's cast something. Ouch. I don't know what I even got hit by. Was that like a meteor? I don't know. Oh, well. Let's go ahead and get better look at this. It's Kofane, Tyrios, and Herzog. That's the uh, Terminus Watchtower. If you have to go, go look for it, you have to look at the Altar of Prayer and all of those areas. Alright, I'm gonna respawn and uh, end the recording. Or actually, to sum up. Save point here, save point here, save point here, save point here. Boss is here, uh, boss here, boss over here, uh, boss inside that Seraphagus. There's two trader bosses over there. Um, at the training field, there's like a uh, mana orb or whatever right there. All the NPCs you can, of course, locate on the map. Um, you can get to the lake area over here, but you have to come in from this side. You cannot get to it from this side at all. It ends in like a cliff. Um, what else? What else? What else? Velasco Giovannis is cut off. Uh, even though it looks like you can physically walk into it, I don't think I showed you guys, but there's an invisible rectangle blocking you from actually getting through that uh, entrance. 
and uh, lots of stealth detection and very, very, very tough mobs here on either side of it. Uh, so I don't suggest going into that area if you uh, don't have to. And um, other than that, not too much else to say. Uh, Observia is signing off.